Greetings in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ to the city elders of the Tulsa metropolitan area across the state of Oklahoma and beyond. I have a powerful word. I, I believe it's prophetic. It's not just didactic. It's not systematic teaching from the word of God. I believe I have a word from the Lord that and we've been talking about being positioned for possession, being at the Jordan, ready to go in, to receive, not just receive, but to take our inheritance. It's key. You must take. The kingdom of God suffers violence, and the violent take it by force. And so it is an inheritance, but we must take it. Now, I want to read to you from the book of Joshua, um, chapter 3, powerful, powerful concept here. And Joshua said unto the people, sanctify yourselves, set yourself apart. I love this. I've been doing this since a teenager. To set two, three days aside and seek God, set yourself apart. Now, you're going to have an opportunity at the beginning of November to set yourself apart for three days. Joshua said to the people, sanctify yourselves. For tomorrow, the Lord will do wonders among you. Now, I had not noticed that verse before, but I'd always thought that transitioning from the wilderness into Jericho and into Canaan, into the promised land, was a transition from the natural into the supernatural. We know that the fall of Jericho and the defeat of the kings. We know it was supernatural. The Bible says that there were more people slain by hailstones. That's when the southern confederacy of Canaanite tribes came together against Israel. They slew many, but the Bible says there were more killed by hailstones. That means supernatural imposition of the extended hand of God in the miraculous. Now, Notice that Joshua said, sanctify, set yourself apart. Take some time here to focus. Because the Lord's going to do wonders. The word's pala, P-A-L-A -A in the Hebrew. Transliteration. It means marvelous, miraculous. Oftentimes the word's translated difficult, meaning it's something that cannot be done by you or by the natural. And the Lord said to jo Joshua, and Joshua said to the people, set yourself apart, focus, sanctify yourself, because you're moving into the realm of the supernatural. You're going to have victories. Oh, I, I feel the Holy Ghost on this, my friend. I feel the Spirit of God welling up in my spirit over this, that that's where we are. Not just city elders, but as a nation, as a people, as the ecclesia. Prepare yourself because you're moving into the realm where God moves supernaturally. You will see mountains move that you cannot move by yourself. You will see barriers broken down that you could not take down by yourself. Oh, this is a special time. This is a special time. Get ready. Prepare yourself. And and for announcement's sake, you're going to have an opportunity November 2nd, 3rd, and 4th. Thursday night banquet with Kevin Hearn. Conference with John O'Connor. With Bill Ledbetter with Dutch Sheets, with David Bullard, and with Ryan Walters, and then we have people that are going to be participating from different states. It's going to be powerful. I sense God on this meeting. Now, the churches, the pastors that have been participating with, with us at the leadership level, on Friday night we're having a rally. Now, there'll be sessions Friday morning, Friday afternoon, and Friday evening, but Friday evening Dutch Sheets is going to be with us. And God has given Dutch a word that is so powerful. It is catalytic. It will put
push us into our inheritance. I, I believe it's just such divine timing. The conference will go through Saturday morning at noon. You're not going to want to miss any of it. Now, there's there's three kinds of registration when you go to the website. You can register for the banquet and the conference at a discounted price. Now, this is a, the banquet is a fundraiser for us, so the price is not the normal price. But I want you to do your best. Those of you that have sponsored tables, those of you that have invited to fill a table, this will be not be tables of eight. It will be tables of ten. I'm not asking you to pay for it. Now, some of you may, you may be able to do that. You may be able to register and pay for an entire table. But uh, you can invite people and get 10 people at your table. That's what I'm encouraging you to do. If you've ever sponsored a table, if you've ever taken the responsibility to fill a table, this is the time to do it. That's the banquet Thursday evening, November the 2nd with Kevin Hearn. Then the conference begins on the 3rd, which is the Friday. Morning sessions, afternoon session, evening session with Dutch Sheets. Now, that evening session, I want you to invite and register as many people. This isn't just for leaders. This isn't just for, for elders and church leaders and government leaders and business leaders. You're going to want to get your people to this meeting. I'm believing. I, I'm not just believing. I know there's going to be a supernatural outpouring of the Holy Spirit. If you have people who have not been baptized in the Holy Spirit, you need to have them there. If you have people who need a miracle, you need to have them there. You have elders or leaders, deacons, people that help you in the ministry, pastor, you need to have them there. They are going to receive a fresh infilling and empowerment and enablement that is going to bless you as a leader when your leaders are strengthened, empowered, inspired, emboldened. This is that night, Friday night. November the 3rd, and then Saturday we'll have a laying on of hands. It's going to be powerful, and it's going to be catalytic for city elders to push us into the next stage of our mission. So don't miss it. There Again, there are three levels of registration. You can register for the banquet only. You can register for the conference only, which is Friday and Saturday, or you can get a $10 discount and register for all three. It's, there's three levels of registration, so you can you can register for both the, the banquet and the conference in the same link. So uh, do your homework. Let's work hard. Let's fill the place up, not just the banquet on Thursday night, but we have a, a larger hall on the other side that uh, we're, we're wanting to fill up with people who need to be filled up, empowered. So don't miss it. I love you. Um, this is an exciting time. We're going to see victory after victory after victory. For the kingdom of God is forcefully advancing. The kingdom of God suffers violence. And the violent take it by force. Get registered. Get ready. Blessings. Bye. The Lord God Almighty promised Joshua, Every place the sole of your foot shall tread upon, that have I given unto you. It's now time for you and the Church of the Living God to take your territory. Learn how to possess the promises of God from these territory-taking leaders. United States Congressman Kevin Hearn, Attorney General John O'Connor, State Superintendent of Public Education Ryan Walters, Oklahoma State Senator David Bullard, Apostolic Prophetic General Dutch Sheets, and Senior Statesman Bill Ledbetter. Don't miss Take Your Territory, hosted by city elders at the Tulsa Marriott Southern Hills, 
November 2, 3, and 4. Registration is required at cityelders.com.